Stopping today's HealthCast, a new vaccine is showing some promise in women with recurrent urinary tract infections. A study done in Canada found that these two oral sprays daily for three months did reduce the risk of recurrent UTIs. Dr. Ricardo Palmarola with Mount Sinai Medical Center says it also appears to keep a number of women completely free of infection. Without the vaccine, um, it's, uh, it's estimated about 40% of UTIs can be basically warded off by your own immune system. So with a vaccine, it helps um, optimize the immune function to actually ward off infections without antibiotics. And that's really the hope of this new paradigm shift of, of treating recurrent urinary tract infections. Now the doctor goes on to say the study focused on women with these uncomplicated UTIs. So there's no data yet on the vaccine's potential use for men, for children, or for others who have complicated infections. And while the link between cholesterol and heart disease is pretty well known, new research now shows a possible connection to Alzheimer's disease as well. A study published this week in the journal Neurology showed a strong link between fluctuating cholesterol levels and dementia. Researchers say patients whose lipid levels fluctuate up and down over a five-year period have a 19% higher risk of getting Alzheimer's disease. Now with this information, doctors may be able to use routine screenings for cholesterol and triglyceride levels to help prevent dementia going forward. And researchers do hope that diet and exercise along with prescribed medications and supplements could actually offer some new hope in preventing the onset of dementia.